Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into a story that sounds straight out of a spy thriller, how Chinese hackers managed to breach some of the biggest telecom companies in the US. This cyber attack wasn't just about stealing data. It's a major play in the game of global espionage. Let's break it all down. How they did it, what they were after, and what it means for all of us. Let's get started. In the age of digital warfare, data is the ultimate weapon. Today, we're unraveling a major cyber espionage incident, how Chinese hackers breached U.S. telecom systems. Earlier this year, Chinese state-sponsored hackers, identified as Salt Typhoon, infiltrated the systems of major U.S. telecom companies like Verizon and AT&T. Their target? Sensitive communication data and surveillance networks used for lawful wiretaps by law enforcement. The operation wasn't just about hacking, it was about stealing intelligence and gaining a strategic edge in global geopolitics. This breach was far from a simple smash and grab. The attackers exploited vulnerabilities in telecom infrastructure. Here's how they pulled it off. The hackers zeroed in on systems designed to intercept communications for law enforcement purposes. Ironically, these systems were meant to protect us. Using custom malware like Ghost Spider, the attackers gained unauthorized access and moved laterally across networks to avoid detection. They didn't just breach the systems, they stayed hidden, gathering intelligence for months. The implications of this attack are enormous. Here's what's at stake. Everything from call metadata to surveillance details was at risk. Government officials, corporations, and everyday citizens could have had their communications exposed. Access to this data gives adversaries an unprecedented advantage, potentially compromising strategic decisions and operations. This isn't just about one attack, it's part of a broader trend in cyber warfare. This breach aligns with China's long-term strategy to dominate in cyberspace, targeting critical infrastructure worldwide. Attacks like these signal the growing risks of geopolitical tensions playing out in the digital realm. So what's being done to address this? The FBI and CISA quickly stepped in, notifying affected companies and sharing security advisories. They're also working to strengthen defenses across the telecom sector. Companies are urged to adopt measures like multi-factor authentication, regular software updates, and thorough employee training to prevent similar incidents. This breach is a wake-up call for organizations worldwide. It's a reminder that no system is truly invulnerable. Cybersecurity must be a priority, not an afterthought. From regular audits to advanced threat detection, vigilance is key. Governments and private sectors must work together to defend against these evolving threats. The SALT Typhoon attack underscores the fragility of our digital infrastructure in an era of cyber warfare. What do you think? Is this just the beginning of a larger trend? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more insights into the world of cybersecurity.